fantastic op opportunity to be here in, in New York, especially with this number of people that we're anticipating for the show here. Um, it's, you know, we, we don't quite often get to have shows of this size or magnitude. I've heard a lot about it and I couldn't wait to be here. It's going to be pretty exciting over the water. It's always a, a very uh, exciting uh, scenery for us and for the team. Flying over water is always a, a challenge, so it's, it's going to be very exciting. And uh, obviously with the, this being our first show with such a, a huge crowd, there's going to be uh, lots of excitement in the air. Well, we're flying the CT114 Canadian built uh, Tudor. Uh, it's built to uh, Canada's colors. And uh, we uh, put on a show of about 50 formation uh, and maneuvers, crosses, bursts, uh, split, you name it. Uh, and that's all time to uh, all coordinated to music and narration. So that's that's pretty much what the team does on the road for about six months of the year. Uh, the aim and the mission is uh, is the same as the Blue Angels or the Thunderbirds, but we use different aircraft. If the uh, the clouds part and we get some sunshine, we've got a great uh, high show that we put on. And the high show uh, is anywhere between 30 and 35 minutes in length. Imagine driving on a highway about uh, 200 miles an hour and uh, you're flying four feet from the other guy and all you look at is the rear wheel, rear right, right wheel, and that's your reference. And you gotta make sure you turn at the right time and stop at the same time and accelerate at the same time. So that's, that's how you can compare it to what people would feel uh, if they were trying to do the same thing in the car. The Tudor itself is a little bit slower than some of the modern jets and it's a little bit older and everything, but one of the wonderful things about that is that we're actually able to stay on stage in front of the crowd for a lot longer. The Tudor is almost like a classic British sports car in that you feel it not that you really want to feel every bump in the road, but you really feel like you're flying this aircraft. It's, uh, it's just a fantastic experience to fly something like this, this airplane, and uh, it's a true aviator's uh, aircraft.